What is going on, y'all? Welcome to the video. We're in Houston for the weekend. Beautiful gotta, day. Yeah, I gotta tell you, man, every time I'm in Houston, I remember why we moved away from Houston. Is the car really not gonna... I told Max, he's like, is there any chance the car's not gonna unlock for us with these clips? He's like, no, no way, it'll be there. It'll unlock as soon as we get there. You know what? A Jeep would never do that. <sighs> Fucking Jeeps, man. <laughs> Guess what, though? Tomorrow's Black Friday. Which means this is Black Friday week, which means that right now you can get the best men's supplement in the world, Greens Plus Test. What are you doing? Showing them the supplement. If you buy one Greens Plus Test right now, you get a second one free. Have you been taking that ashwagandha again, bro? Because <laughs> there's nothing on your hands. These are the two Greens Plus Test right here, man. This combines the top two men's supplements, an organic greens powder for overall health and longevity, and a powerful testosterone boosting complex that utilizes Tonkat Ali and ashwagandha, the top two natural compounds clinically proven to work. All of that in one delicious green apple flavor scoop per day. And right now you can buy one and get one free. This man is losing his mind. <laughs> First link in description. Don't miss out. Man, I fucking hate when I forget my greens plus test when I'm traveling. I hate when I forget my greens and my test. You need some. <laughs> I do need some, bro. <laughs> so we're getting the day started with the workout. Honestly, I've been missing workouts left and right, getting ready for Black Friday at Alpha Land. And the really cool thing about Alpha Land is actually three gyms. There's an indoor gym, outdoor gym, and then this is called Gym 3. The beautiful thing about this is no one's ever here. So today we're working out me, Max, and Joe, who, uh, you still owe me your McLaren. No, I owe him your cousin my McLaren. Me and my cousin beat Joe in golf a couple weeks ago. Your cousin beat me in golf. Easy. Easy. I'm, I'm mad. I'm mad, I'm upset. See, this is what Joe's trying to do. He's trying to pretend like I didn't beat him. You did beat him. So I'll, I'm, I'll be waiting for the keys to come in the mail. Why don't we play again? 1v1, one one. double or nothing. I'll, I'll give you two McLarens. I'm down. I got a question for the vlog. If there's a giant mirror with fog, you're legally obligated to draw a dick in it, right? Like, but that's our friend that owns a gym, so I can't do it. But like, I, I want to draw this in that. Anyway, today we're hitting a full body push workout in the Beastly app. Let's get these gains, bro. Games, bro. Workout complete. Sweaty ass Houston workout. Look at even my pants. Show show my pants. Even my pants are sweaty. You know, speaking of gains and bros, a big congrats to Max right here. He just made some super big uh, life gains, I would say. Sour Strips, the candy company you started in 2019. Yeah, this one right here. There's nothing here, bro. The one he started too much ashwagandha, bro. <laughs> The one he started in 2019, he just sold it five years lady, later to Hershey's. He's going to tell us how much he sold it for in a minute. But first, I'm curious. There's a lot of people watching the channel. They're trying to start their own business or side hustle, struggling to get momentum in the early stages. So what is something you did right? Because you didn't get any loans or outside investments. What is something you did right at the beginning to allow it to, to grow crazy like this? I think there's like three main takeaways. One is to start a business about something that you're already passionate about because then it's easy to find flaws or find like a gap in the market about, like if you dislike something about a certain product or service or whatever, like there's a chance there's a lot of other people too. So so with so with the candy, you thought there was no candy, it was like branded really cool. It was all like old school brand. I think it was the quality of the product, like the level of sour, but also the, the packaging, the branding, there wasn't like this kind of modern branding. Um, Same thing with me with Edge. Yeah. We haven't sold it to Hershey's yet, but uh, Similar, like I was working with Alfleet, and there was like certain things I, I wanted to do differently about the type of clothing. So I was like, that gives me yeah, opening so for edge. You gotta just find something you're passionate about because then you're like, you're in it for the right reasons, and hopefully, like money can be like a byproduct of just doing your thing. Second would be to start small and scale as you go. Keep reinvesting money back into the company. Don't be buying yachts and Lambos and shit. I mean, maybe at one point, but or like early on, 
just keep that money going back in. Yeah, for us, I think our first launch was literally like 100 t-shirts, 100 tank tops, sold out, so we doubled it 400, yep. 400, and we kept scaling up so we got to a point where we didn't sell out and then kind of found a happy ground to start scaling from there. Yeah, so be passionate. Don't start, take a huge risk up front. Yeah, start small and scale. Uh, and the third thing would just be like, this sounds like a blatant obvious, but like leverage social media. Like even if you don't have a lot of followers, you can still like places like TikTok, Twitter, whatever, like there, there's so many platforms that all it takes is one video to get out to millions of eyes on your product. So just keep going. If the first one doesn't hit, maybe the hundredth one will. Especially with the short form content like TikToks, Instagram Reels, those you don't need a big following. If you have a video that gets good watch time, has a yeah. strong hook, it can still reach a bigger audience. And if it does well there, then you can also put some paid ad to spend behind it, it'll probably do even better. Yeah, so I mean, you combo those together with some hard work and dedication, and you yourself can live a great life. I think that's a good clip, bro. Wait, hold on, hold on. What? You have to reveal Oh. What was the price that Hershey's paid you for sour strips? Man, I shouldn't be saying this. It's been but... revealed nowhere else. I know, I know. You guys don't say anything, all right? The exact amount was. The golf journey continues. Last week, y'all probably remember I played against a professional, Luke Kwan. That video is coming on Saturday of me playing against a pro golfer. So y'all are gonna get a bonus video this week. It's been uh, a beast to edit it. Stay tuned, Saturday. The funny thing is on Max's channel, I said that my goal was to reach scratch in two years and his comments lost their minds like there's no chance you're gonna reach scratch in two years. Which is correct. It's not gonna take you two years. It's gonna take you 10 months, both of us, before a year, before 12 months. So last time Max and I played, we were on the same team doing a scramble. Today we're switching it up. It's one versus one. This man's about to go downtown big time. We're playing one hole. This is a par four. I think it's like 380 yards out. What are we wagering? I think we put our money where our mouth is. A hundred bucks. And the person has to Venmo the person on the, on the, on the camera. I'll, I'll even give you an extra stroke. You're not that much better than me, bro. Like, I'll give you an extra stroke. This fucking man, what does that even mean? I think Max is in trouble. Big trouble. David's about to be beaten worse than when I destroyed him on his own channel at a race. Uh, apparently, we're 160 yards out. I still do not know what club you're supposed to use. So I just kind of pick one randomly. Is that the three the, hybrid? The three, three hybrid, Paradigm AI smoke. If you hit it well, you could smoke this over the green. When I hit it well. Not my best shot, but not my worst shot. <laughs> it's a little closer to Max's. Oh God, I almost lost the clip. Probably 158. <laughs> so, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with the six iron. This is the one, David, no pressure. Oh my God. I crushed it, bro. I think it went way over the hole. You know what's crazy is like, damn, that was actually a good shot. Okay. Mother. That's all right. Honestly, not bad. After two strokes, I'm gonna have a shot at par here, which is something Max has never heard of. <laughs> <laughs> ah. You suck. <laughs> Made it further. Made it further. So a good golfer wouldn't putt from here, but I could really mess up a chip shot. So I'm gonna, it's like a wet ground is not ideal conditions. I'm gonna try and get it up there on the left. Two putt. Excellent. That's poor sportsman like, you're never gonna get into a country club. For double bogey. Double bogey. Bro, this is why golf is so frustrating. I literally got like right here in two shots and with two more shots of advanced like three meters or some shit. Oh, 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 oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Was that nine? <laughs> Eight? Bro, motherfucking bitch ass. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably not even gonna put this in the video. He's gonna delete it. <laughs> Bro. That, oh, man. Damn. 
So for dinner tonight, it's gonna be a throwback. We got the crew back together. Oh, dinner, bro. You can get dinner because I beat your ass at golf. You know what? What's up? I do owe you, but I think I can do you one better. Instead I, I of dinner, bucks. Nah, nah, bro. I'm gonna hook you up with some edgy lifestyle instead. Bro, this is way more than $100. That's not even fair. I mean, I'll take it. No, usually that would be more, but right now because it's Edge Black Friday, $100, man, it can take you a very long way because everything on the website, even the new releases like the Shadow T, the Lux Joggers, you're wearing the casual chinos, I see. Everything even on the new discount. Stuff that just came out? Even the new stuff that just came out, everything is on discount. Bro, you're going to take a loss on this, man. Up to 60% off. Edge has you covered with easy style level ups for the colder months, like the brand new Berlin jackets or the premium denim jeans now available in a dark blue colorway. New gym fits with the brand new enhanced mesh tank that makes you look jacked. The tech joggers, the luxe joggers, the movement joggers, the performance joggers. Our active chinos are back in stock for when you need to dress up. And the active polo is back in stock also and available in the new black colorway. Just go to edgelifestyle.com or click that link in description to shop now but do not hesitate these deals these are the biggest deals of the year they end on monday and once they're gone they're gone forever so we're back at our go-to houston restaurant lupe tortilla we got the wives here that's the first time that i can say we got the wives here because they are officially married and, and you know what this is the first time I've had a frozen margarita in a long time, bro. I've switched away from frozen margaritas since since we've been away from you. Man, your whole life's changing, man. You, you, you lose to me at golf. You drink frozen margaritas now. Man, I made it spicy, though. We'll see, we'll see how spicy it is. Right? No straw. No straw. That's a really good margarita. Bro, these fajitas are looking extra delicious. That's because we're trying to convince you to move back to Houston. We upgraded your meat game. Normally go with the beef, this one, the filet. So tender, so delicious, 10 out of 10. Damn bro, these are really good. In fact, I'll show you a spot in Austin that does them even better. You could just move to Austin with us. How about that? How about this bro, if this video gets 30,000 likes, I'll move to Austin. Fuck. <laughs> well over 30,000 y'all will watch this and you'll just watch this segment and not thumbs up the video. And you'll also watch the segment of him saying that you're gonna watch the segment and not thumbs up the video. And you're gonna go, still not thumbs up in the video. So we are back in Austin. Always an amazing time visiting our good friends in Houston. Love, love them, hate Houston. <laughs> Tonight we're going to see a movie that, I haven't seen the trailer for this. And sometimes that goes good, sometimes that goes bad. It's called Red One with the Rock. I was going to say Martin Lawrence. He looks nothing like The Rock. With The Rock, it's got the right ratio of Rotten Tomatoes reviews where the critics gave a low scores and the audience gave a high scores. That's the golden ratio. Usually it means good things. And it's a Christmas movie. Let's see. 500. Let's go heavy. Yeah. Got it. Looking strong, Nick. Someone took Nick. We got snowmen! Red One movie review. Like a six out of ten. It's a Christmas movie. Typical. There's a danger you risk when you don't watch the trailer first. Six six out of ten. You were sleeping the whole time. Literally, I look over and he's just like passed out. But there's one golden rule. <laughs> when someone, there's when Julia like, well, she's like, hey, you're sleeping. There's a golden rule. You never admit you're sleeping. When you're sleeping during a movie, you're like, nah, I'm, I'm awake. I'm, <laughs> I'm awake. putting my hand in front of him and he's like, nah, 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 I'm awake. I'm awake. I don't recommend this movie, but I am very excited because next week, Gladiator 2 comes out. Gladiator 1 was the greatest movie of all time. Which means this one will probably disappoint me if I'm being honest. It's, it's got a big shoes to fill, but still kind of excited. Man, it feels good to be home, bro. Back at the casa. A few upgrades coming to the house soon, so stay tuned for those. If you made it to the end of this video, I appreciate you. Thank you for watching. If you picked something up from one of the Black Friday sales, thank you from the bottom of my heart. I appreciate you supporting. Those deals are still going on, by the way, but, but, but not for too much longer. Don't stop watching now, though. You can click right there to check out my most recent upload. That one was a banger. Click there to watch it now. There's a bug on my ear. I'll talk to you in the next video. Stay beastly.